Hello Church, we're looking at Luke chapters 13 and 14 today for our daily Bible reading. Where the day is loss. We looked at yesterday the promise that Christ gives us, the Holy Spirit will be there to help us know what to say and how to live. Here we're going to see that the disciples ask kind of a good question about following Christ and what does it mean to give up or what might you have to sacrifice. And so this is what he promises them in chapter 14, starting in verse 25. This is Jesus speaking. Well, so before that, 25. Now when the great multitudes went with him, he turned and said to them, If anyone comes to me and does not hate his father and mother, wife and children, brothers and sisters, yes, and his own life also, he cannot be my disciple. And whoever does not bear his cross and come after me cannot be my disciple. For which of you intending to build a tower does not sit down first and count the cost, whether he has enough to finish it? Lest after he has laid the foundation and is not able to finish, all who see it begin to mock him, saying, This man began to build and was not able to finish. Or what kind, what king going to make war against another king does not sit down first and consider whether he is able with 10,000 to meet him who comes against him with 20,000? Or else while the other is still a great way off, he sends a delegation and asks for conditions of peace. So, likewise, whoever of you does, does not forsake all that he has cannot be my disciple. Christ wants us to consider the lost. Will we be willing to give up everything, to leave everything, to listen to the life lessons that Christ has given us to obey him? Because it is not an easy path. But the reward is great. It's eternal life with God. It's blessings that will last for eternity. And so let us consider rightly what we're willing to give up and sacrifice in order to love and to serve our God. Regardless of the loss, it may cost us now. All right, church, have a great day.